Hi everyone. In today's university lesson, we are learning about eleven and twelve times tables. It's an easy way to remember them. Let's get started. So let's first start with the eleven times table, which is one of the easiest timetables to remember.、Um, so if you are multiplying a one-digit number by eleven, you just need to repeat that digit. So let's have a look at these examples. So, for example, eleven times one equals eleven. You write number one and you repeat the same digit. Eleven times two equals twenty-two. You write number two and repeat the same digit. Eleven times three is thirty-three. You write number three and repeat the same digit, and the same goes on with all the numbers. So, this is a very simple rule when you are multiplying eleven by a two-digit number. So you write the number that you're multiplying by and leave a gap in between the two digits. Then add those two digits and write the answer in the middle of the other two numbers. So in this example, eleven times ten equals. I write number ten and I leave a gap in between the two digits. Then I add one and zero together, which equals one, and I put that one right in the middle of the two other digits. So the answer is one hundred and ten. Another example: eleven times eleven. So I write number eleven and I leave a gap in between the two digits. Then I add one and one together, which equals two, and I put that two in the middle of the two digits. So the answer is one hundred and twenty-one. What about eleven times twelve? So I write number twelve and leave a gap in between the two digits. Then I add one and two together, which equals three, and I put that three in the middle of the two digits. So the answer is one hundred and thirty-two. So the same rule applies to the bigger numbers. Eleven times thirty-five. So I write number thirty-five and leave a gap in between the two digits. Then add three and five together, which equals eight, and I put that eight right in the middle of the two digits. So the answer is three hundred and eighty-five. Now let's move to twelve timetables, and I'm going to show you a very simple trick. So for twelve timetables, I'm going to write my numbers from one to fourteen, but missing out numbers five and eleven. So I'm going to write one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Then I'm going right back to the top again, and I'm going to write two times tables. And when I get to zero, I start from two again. So we write two, four, six, eight, zero, two, four, six, eight, zero, two, four. And now we have it. We have twelve times tables. So we have one times twelve equals twelve. Two times twelve equals twenty-four. Three times twelve equals thirty-six. Four times twelve equals forty-eight, and that goes on all the way down. And that's the end of this video. And if you have learned something new and have enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for your support.